Go kill me back. Vote 5 for next to Dragon Point. It's currently 11.51 p.m. And just in case, it is Friday, March 28, 2014. Though so it won't be for much longer. A thousand dollars in camp. That's easy. You know, even by now, I'm pretty sure that the police would start chasing him for the day. You know, because they keep deliberately crashing. They didn't blow up the oil. First, you're able to not only pass the level, but complete all the bonus challenges on your first try. But it soon gets hard. Oh, there's the cop. Luckily for you, they're just as hard to destroy. Luckily, they're just as hard to destroy as all the other cops. And so are animals. Destroy a bank and that'll cause me a lot of damage. $60,000. I just needed one more crash. Those was just one thousand dollars. Don't aim for the bank. It only causes ten thousand dollars of damage. That was pretty devastating, and I just got a five-point congregate badge for destroying a hundred vehicles. I doubt this counts as justice, considering how many homicides this causes. Yep, there are limousines. Attack with a crank. Almost no damage. Practically zero damage. Now plus it's worth twice as much as a bank. Destroying the gas station approximately causes twenty thousand dollars in damage. Here you only need to cost thirty thousand dollars in damage. It's easy to get that much damage. In a crash. What's harder is uh, uh oh.
those nuclear tanks are worth sixty thousand dollars. Five plus. <laughs> That was absolutely horrifying. Oh, look at that. Over a hundred and fifty thousand dollars of damage. They set certain goals for all their terrorist attacks. Yeah, this counts as terrorism since it is hardly causing civilian attacks. $90,000 a hard over me. Pretty hard. But this far into this, this game. There is really no way to tell how much damage Well, we caused over a hundred thousand dollars of damage. Better, but not nearly good enough. Impressive. We destroyed not only the bank, but the gas station. Destroy the hospital. Kill all the people. Pretty high on the terrorism. Pretty high on the terrorism scale because we wind up killing all the sick patients and it's worth twenty thousand dollars. Guess how many fatalities that causes? Approximately eighteen. Even more if some of them were powerful. Which is like. Alright, we destroyed two banks. Okay, so the strategy here is to go target the hostage. We at least managed to damage the bank. We're getting closer. Maybe slightly. Well, we got the pig. Approximately how many devastating accidents do you guys need to cause before you're dead? Yeah. 
The only way to win is to blow up that gas station. Told ya. However, we did blow up both gas stations and some of the gas oil trucks. Using a nuclear bar. That's even more extreme than 9-11. And that was what a plane was plane was crashed between the World Trade Center. This far into the game, the what you have to your goals start to become real specific. That fulfills the goal. And even one of the challenges. Bonus challenge. <laughs> the terrorist attacks start to have a flaw. Those planes are pretty expensive. Blowing two of those up. We at least got one. First we're able to get to a F to a F sixteen is simply damaging. The best we're able to do is these characters. That's nothing. Absolutely nothing. Despite the impressive amount of damage... Ah, uh, shit. We actually managed to blow up three. That should make those... That should make it easier to attack the Americans. Or whatever country this takes place is. It has to be Russia, Germany... Brazil... Maybe even China. Oh, ooh, uh, You wonder how I managed to make the game slip like that. Just by clicking the right button. Pretty, pretty amazing an oil truck didn't get destroyed in that blast. Either that, or they're not keeping track. But we did blow up the gas station. Two of them, in fact, unless one of them was a... Oh, wait, this is a traffic control. Still, pretty impressive to do 30 terrorist attacks without getting caught by, you know, the American forces such as NATO. You expect those animals by now to get caught by NATO or some other American. Thirty terrorist attacks.
this is the point in which it starts to get hard. That wasn't successful. At all. Pretty clever to destroy the traffic control that makes the cars run the other traffic in the other cars. I mean, the closest I know that we had to get so far here is done. Seven. We're getting worse here. Hey, Eight. Let's try something else. If we target the traffic, we only get one. So I guess we just repeatedly target the traffic control and hope we get ten. Which seems highly unlikely of ever happening. Finally, blow up the Jeep. That many nuclear tanks? This must be Russia. Because the Soviet Union is known for having a lot of nuclear warheads. Oh, we managed to hide that guy to F-16. All you can do is do this level is simply to a speed run. Says there's little penalty to give you the level. That's a lot of lost oil. You can imagine how much money it's going to cost to get it. You know, to replace all the oil. We're pretty unlikely to get the police gun. Now they don't let you go skip a level until you try to do that. <laughs> Only one missile truck appears in the entire level. That missile truck right over there. Unfortunately, by the time it comes, Better to damage the missile truck, although that won't let us pass the level. Oh. 
That's pretty impressive. Leaving. And then we destroyed the Chevy Control Building anyway. Looks impossible, right? Looks impossible, right? It's not. In fact, I completed both challenges on it. Your only chance of successfully completing the challenge, completing this level, is to destroy the trap That's the only chance you got. Not only do you have to crash in the traffic control building, you have to have good reflexes. So you need to have enough punch to not only really crash, crash into the traffic control building enough to destroy it, but you also need to be, well, you also need to be lucky enough to do it at the exact moment. Who am I talking to? There is no one to talk to. But what do you want to talk about? I got lucky. I've only completed 31 challenges. My best chance is to... Well, I at least completed one challenge. Level 5 didn't earn any challenges on that one. What are some of the challenges? Oh yeah, both challenges. Our best, ch we have the best chances with level 7. We only have to do one of the challenges. Now, I'll see you. 
that's what the bugger is all scared of. We actually managed to pile on another 50, and we got a 15 point congregate badge just for doing that many terrorist attacks. We'll also get a lifetime in prison. Actually, we'll get the death penalty for sure. I mean, come on, we blew up both gas stations, both of the gas stations, and 40 cars. Along with causing a devastating amount of damage. Look at the statistics. Six million dollars of damage. We are definitely getting the death penalty for causing that many, that much damage. As well as blowing up 920 cars. <coughs> Derailing 29 trains. Demolishing 9 missile trucks. Blowing up 51 cars in a single terrorist attack with the most damaging terrorist attack being the one we just did. And you're telling me that they're just going to look that over? No, no. All that happened was that one animal was ran over. And you decided to cause six million dollars of damage. I say, the humans now need revenge. It's currently 12.18 a.m. Till next time.